Well, Merry Christmas. Hi, I'm Bill Stubbs, and this is your classic life, and this is my dining room table as I typically set it for the Christmas holidays. Uh, this is a combination of things that I've collected really over years and years. Uh, these, it looks like something that I went out and purchased to create this opulent uh, table all at once, but I really don't operate like that. I collect things, and I have an eye for the colors that I want to use, and I build around that. So I have this this orange china that I've had for years and years and years, and uh, this was considered a very trendy thing when we bought it, and and very atypical and not classic. But now I think it looks very classic. It's been a long time. I use these uh, bronze colored napkins that I bought at a discount store. They were very inexpensive. I bought lots of them, so if they get stained and we wash them. I found these sweet little birds that were on sale as napkin rings that I think go very well with this table. Then I have, these are just pine cones that you find on the ground. You spray them with a bronze colored paint and then dip them in bronze glitter. It's a really simple, but look how opulent that looks. Now, I do love this wonderful uh, nativity. Now, this looks like a, a hand-carved Italian nativity, and actually I found it at a discount store for $10. It's sitting on top of a shoebox, which I use oftentimes when I'm setting a table. I like a little height and a little drama. So there's a shoebox here, then I've taken this remnant of fabric and bunched it all up, put more of the pine cones. I found these on sale after Christmas once, uh, I have the nice votives that add a lot of flicker and th th the, uh, the placemats are these beautiful beaded bronze placemats and uh, I found those at, uh, at a discount store for about $10 a piece. Uh, th this is my grandmother's uh, crystal, my grandmother's silver. Uh, so things that I've been collecting for years and years and years. I always look around for uh, this is a, a little wrapped present. I like to put a few chocolates in here and have it as a gift or as a place card. Sometimes I'll put the person's name on the gift so that they know where they're seated. Uh, and then I wrap it and put it as a gift to make it a little special for a, an evening. But this is my idea of a classic dinner table for the holidays.